Have you ever wondered why aloe vera seems to be in everything these days? From skincare creams and sunburn gels to health drinks and supplements, this spiky green plant has taken over bathroom shelves and health stores worldwide. But here's the question. How does it go from those spiky leaves to the smooth gel we all know and love? And is it really as miraculous as people claim? Well, stick around because today we're pulling back the curtain on the fascinating journey of aloe vera. From its ancient roots to modern day production, we'll explore the farming, harvesting and extraction processes, uncover its many benefits, and show you how this powerful plant can change your health and skincare routine. Trust me, you don't wanna miss this. Let's dive in. Did you know humans have been using aloe vera for over 4,000 years? Legend has it that even Queen Cleopatra used it to keep her skin soft and glowing. Today, this plant continues to amaze us with its soothing and healing powers. But what makes aloe vera so special and how does it get from farm to your skincare products? In this video, we'll explore the secrets of aloe vera step by step and show you just how this ancient plant delivers modern miracles. Let's get started. Let's rewind to over 4,000 years ago. Aloe vera wasn't just a plant, it was a beauty secret and a medicinal marvel. Legend has it that Queen Cleopatra herself used aloe to keep her skin soft and youthful. But it didn't stop there. The ancient Greeks and Romans also prized aloe for its healing effects, and its fame eventually spread across continents. Today, aloe vera is one of 300 species of aloe found worldwide. While it may look like a cactus, it's actually a succulent related to garlic, onions, and asparagus. Originally native to Africa, aloe vera now thrives in warm climates across the globe, from Latin America to India. Now, growing aloe vera isn't as simple as tossing seeds into the soil. Farmers use offshoots or cuttings, not seeds, to cultivate aloe. Why? This method preserves essential traits like leaf size, gel quality, and pest resistance. Plus, offshoots root faster, allowing for earlier harvests. Here's what the perfect aloe vera plant needs. It takes up to five years to mature. It requires about 2,000 hours of sunshine every year to develop those powerful active ingredients. Wow. 
Once mature, aloe vera plants are selectively harvested, meaning only the outer leaves are cut. This allows the plant to regenerate naturally, ensuring sustainability and long-term productivity. Once mature, aloe vera plants are selectively harvested, meaning only the outer leaves are cut. This allows the plant to regenerate naturally, ensuring sustainability and long-term productivity. Here's how it's done. First, the spiny edges are trimmed. These are actually the plant's mouths where it breathes. Next, the top layer of the leaf is cut just a few millimeters below the skin. Using a plastic spatula, yes, the kind you'd find at your local hardware store, the clear gel is scraped away. This inner gel is where the magic happens. It's loaded with vitamins, minerals, amino acids, and polysaccharides, healthy sugars that fight free radicals and promote healing. And just like that, you have pure aloe vera gel. You can eat it, drink it, or apply it to your skin. It tastes a little like slimy cucumber. Not too bad, right? Now that we've extracted the gel, let's see how it's processed for commercial use. The freshly harvested aloe vera gel must be processed the same day to preserve its active ingredients. This is a race against time. Here's how companies do it. Rinsing. The leaves are washed to remove dirt and any remaining alloy. Gel extraction. Two main methods are used. Manual filleting. Skilled workers extract the gel by hand. Machine extraction. Rollers crush the leaves and scrapers remove any leftover gel. Filtration and stabilization. The gel is filtered to remove impurities and traces of alloy. Then it's stabilized to maintain consistency, extend shelf life, and prevent spoilage. Finally, the pure aloe vera gel is packaged into products you know and love, like skin creams, juices, and even health supplements. So why is aloe vera so popular? Here are its top benefits. Skin care. Aloe soothes burns, reduces inflammation, and hydrates your skin. Digestive health. Drinking aloe juice can support gut health and reduce irritation. Healing power. Its antioxidants and polysaccharides fight free radicals and speed up healing. best part? You don't need much. Just a small piece of gel daily can do wonders for your skin and overall health.
Aloe vera is nature's gift, simple, powerful, and healing. Whether you're using it for skincare, sunburns, or a health boost, its benefits are endless. If you enjoyed learning about the journey of aloe vera, from farms to products, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos about nature's best kept secrets. And tell me in the comments, have you ever tried fresh aloe vera gel? Would you eat it, drink it, or use it on your skin? I'd love to hear your thoughts. Until next time, stay healthy, stay curious, and keep exploring the wonders of nature.